What's up guys, my name is Number here for Troubleshoot and I'm back with another super niche tutorial. So in today's video, I'm going to be covering a rather weird thing that happens with VC package, at least for me. And if you're having this issue, then this is probably the solution that you're looking for. What exactly am I talking about? Well, heading across to my VC package directory and opening it in PowerShell. If I go ahead and run VC package list, you can see that I have crypto plus plus 64 windows static and the 86 version installed. If I were to go ahead and remove one of them as such, then upon removing it, if I were to go ahead and try to reinstall it, you'll see some sort of an error. If I go ahead and search for crypto plus plus, then you might see an error like this. If your library is not listed, please open an issue and or consider making a pull request here. So what exactly is happening? Well, sometimes after uninstalling or removing a package, it tends to remove the actual build files itself and ends up breaking it for some reason. Why exactly this happens, I have no clue, but it's definitely not intended because I can go ahead and download the full Git project, build VC package, and all of a sudden Crypto++ or whatever library actually downloads. What exactly is going wrong? Well, having a look inside of the ports folder over here, this is everything that is currently possible to be built with a VC package. If I go ahead and type in crypto plus plus, you can see that there is no crypto plus plus here. There's curl and the rest of it. Now, if I go ahead and have a look at it on the actual GitHub page, you can see that if I head into the ports page, I can scroll down until I find crypto plus plus over here. And here's all the files that I should have inside of this ports folder over here, but I don't. So all we really need to do is download these files and place them back into the ports folder over here. I'll simply go ahead and make a crypto plus plus folder because I currently don't have one. But of course, you may have one with one or two files inside of it already. This is the issue that I had. And then when you have this over here, you're not able to download all of these files as one. You can either go ahead and download the entire package or download them separately. Or at least that's what you may be thinking. Linked down below will be down git. What exactly is down git? Well, simply copy this page over here, paste it in, click download, and you'll download only the one folder that we have selected over here. So ports, crypto PP, opening up the zip, here's crypto PP with all four files inside of it. Super useful. I'll drag and drop them across into the folder in the ports folder. Then if I go ahead and run VC package again, search for the project, you can see that this time I have crypto plus plus here, as well as another entry. Then if I wanted to, I could go ahead and install it and you'd see that it builds as expected instead of just giving me some kind of port definition error or something along those lines. So of course, this isn't exactly guaranteed to fix it for you, but it may very well do so. If you're still having issues actually building it, you can go ahead and re-download VC package, simply put it in a new folder, run the bootstrap and then test to see if you can actually install the project. And if you can, well, then there's something wrong with your current installation. If you can't, then it's worth reaching out on the VC package GitHub page or the creator of whatever project you're trying to install. As you can see, it's successfully built and installed. Anyways, that's about it. Thank you for watching. My name's been Techno here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.